and gentlemen, how are we all doing today? And welcome to the first episode of Madden 21's No Money Spent. Now, in today's episode, this will all be about building a team that we can take online and absolutely dominate. But if you're a veteran of the series you watched last year, you will know that getting to online play, building a team that I'm actually comfortable with, is gonna take a while so stay tuned for that just as a little mini sneak peek you guys see i have 200,000 coins right now we're not gonna spend those just yet i'm probably gonna save them and do a spending spree in the next episode or the episode after that i'm not exactly sure but i have a lot of players to show you that i've been grinding for now before we get into the main parts of the video i just want to say if you're new to my channel make sure to hit that subscribe button down below i do gameplays pack openings but the most important thing that i do on my channel is no money spent so if you're an aspiring no money spent player or you're a current no money spent player you want to stay sub to this channel this is the place to be without further ado let's go ahead and get into episode one let's go pop pop Pop. What makes you think I'm not okay with that? I took my backpack off, off, off. Ready to change the game and run the track. Y'all thinking I'ma fall off. I'm Thomas the Itch. Two seconds, you get your rocks off. That's why they said you're all soft. So I paint over the scene like I'm Bob Ross. I got weed songs. If you smoke good, I got peace songs. If you ain't so hood, that you can't kick it. Get it. Have a party. Oh shit, homie, don't hurt nobody. So as you guys can see, I am currently Mutt level 48, which is a big way that I've actually earned all these packs and all these coins. What we're gonna do right now is we're gonna go into the unopened packs section. We have some get a go player packs and just regular get a player packs. Now, these aren't gonna be super interesting, but I wanna say that they're not NAT, which is actually pretty good. We get a power up card here, Nick Chubb. Now this is actually a big deal because I think cards like this should go for a solid amount. Let me check. Okay, so Nick Chubb, 74 overall, goes for 26, bro. I'm, I'm not even thinking twice. I'm putting him up right now. This is all because I'm doing solo challenges, guys. 25,000 coins just like that out of a get a gold player pack. That's absolutely fantastic. Just like that, we're going to go ahead and uh, post him up. There we go. All right, he should sell pretty quickly. Anytime you guys pull a power up, I would definitely check its price. The chances of us actually powering up a card this early in the year, it's pretty much not going to happen. So I just sell it immediately, right? Like 26,000 coins. That's a no brainer for me, a card that I'm not even going to use. We got Landon Collins right there. We got, I'm not even going to try to pronounce this dude's name. And in our last and final get a gold player pack, we get a gold player and it's a 72 TJ Logan. Okay, so now we have our silver packs or our get a player packs. It's pretty much base silvers every single time. We could get lucky with the gold and we do. That's pretty good. All of these cars are either going to be quick sold for training or they're going to be sold on the auction block. This is silver. Yeah, we can't really do much with that. I want to say we have two more of these packs. And like I said, again, all of these players are going to be sold. We get actually, this is a rookie card, I want to say. Maybe it's a bronze. That's why it looked that way. I'm not exactly sure, but every single one of these cards is getting hit with the auction house. It's getting sold. Cody Barton. Okay, again, sold. Okay, so as you guys can see, we got a bunch of Caspers here on our lineup. We're going to fill in a couple positions on offense and a couple positions on defense. These are all going to be players that I've acquired over the past two days of absolute grinding. So the first player that we're going to add in, and with the menus being so laggy, it's probably going to take a little bit, but we're going to add in a left tackle, and this was actually a Mutt Reward player, and that is Andrew Whitworth, 82 overall. I want to say you got this from playing Madden 18, Madden 19, and Madden 20. I chose an offensive lineman because no one ever wants to choose offensive linemen, so I chose him, so I don't ever have to upgrade him. So that's who I chose for left tackle. Now we're going to start with some skill positions. This first player is going to be a quarterback. Now, we all know who this is. If you watched my last video, it's how I made over 100,000 coins the first three hours of the game. It's Lamar Jackson. This is the superstar KO version of Lamar Jackson. He's helped me out in a a lot of solo challenges now obviously once i get my pre-order rewards i will be upgrading to the regular lamar jackson but for now is the superstar ko one wider receiver number one now i gotta make sure i don't show anything or too much here because there's another wide receiver we're gonna get that is 86 overall level master andre johnson i don't have him leveled up all the way i want to say he gets to an 89 overall obviously i am working on that i'm currently level what 38 
Now we're gonna upgrade the uh, the wide receiver number two. And this is a player that I acquired that I think is pretty darn good. And that is fan favorite Larry Fitzgerald. Now, obviously this is an NFL Epic card. If you don't know what an NFL Epic card is, it's a card that you can get for free just by doing solo challenges. After I upgrade this team and show you guys what I've done, I'll go over to the solo challenge string and show you exactly which ones you got to do. Now that is it for offense. Defense definitely has, uh, it has more. It has more upgrades. We definitely have a lot more. Our next upgrade is a cornerback and it was actually one of the free ones that you got from uh, loyalty again for playing Madden 19, Madden 20, and Madden 18. I don't know why I went out of order right there, but this is a cornerback. And that is Patrick Peterson, 82 overall. I'll go ahead and throw in the next corner that we get. It's cornerback number four. He's not that important, but it's someone to throw in there. I don't know how long he's going to be on my team, but Justin Coleman, cornerback number four. It's an NAT Elite card that I got from, I don't know, some solo challenge or some mutt level, whatever it may be, but he's on the team cornerback number four. Now, this next card that we have is a middle linebacker, and he's definitely a good. He's definitely a good. And that is NFL Rivals J. Jalen Smith, 85 overall. Again, I will show you guys the solo challenges that you need to do to acquire these players at the end, but this was a no-brainer for me in the NFL Rivals section. At our left outside linebacker position, we have another NFL loyalty player, and that is Darius Leonard again. I wouldn't have normally picked him, but he was the best option out of the five that you get. And you guys will see, I don't know, whenever you get the game, uh, the five players that you get for NFL loyalty. You can choose three out of the five. Now, the next couple players are pretty cool. Uh, this is actually going to be my backup left end, so I'll just I'll go ahead and throw him in there. That is 82 overall, Stefan it Again, he's a backup. He's probably not going to be seeing too much playing time, but he's there. Now, our starting left end is another NFL Epics player, and that is 85 overall. Jack Youngblood. I don't want to show the stats on the back just right now, but he's got some nasty stats. Like I want to say 88 power moves, something like that. The D line is going to be something to reckon with. Trust me. The next player that we're going to add to the defense is actually a Mutt Captain. Now, if you guys know the Mutt Captains, you will know that there are two defensive players, and that is Aeneas Williams and Leroy Glover. And ladies and gentlemen, I went with Leroy Glover. I just feel like it's the best option out of all of them. I'm really not going to want to upgrade my defensive tackle very much and I didn't think Aeneas Williams was fast enough to keep up with a lot of the really high-end wide receivers so I thought Leroy Glover was probably the move for my mutt captain now the last and final card is another NFL epic and he's actually a free safety sometimes plays strong safety and that is 85 overall Ronnie Lott now I'm not gonna lie when I use this card in the solo challenges he made some plays, trust me. He made some absolute plays, so uh, I have high expectations for Ronnie Lott when we get into the head-to-head, -head. but obviously, as you can see on the defense, I got a lot of goons, man. I got an 89 Leroy Glover. We have Jack Youngblood. We have Jalen Smith. We have Ronnie Lott, and that's not even the players that I'm going to acquire with the coins that I have, but that's, that, that's not going to happen in today's episode. This was just kind of building out the team based on the progress that I've made so far. Now, I'm not going to lie, boys. Uh... I kind of cheated you a little bit. There is one other player that I'm gonna add here on offense, and it's actually halfback, and yes, it is an NFL Epics card. And that is 85 overall, Adrian Peterson. Yes, we actually got AP on the team. He has like 86 speed, he's strong. I mean, it's gonna be a good goal line running back. The scheme that I'm running right now, I don't really run the ball that much, uh, if at all. So it's gonna be a lot of passing. So I don't know how well Adrian Peterson is gonna fare in that game, but it's a weapon that we can use. So obviously it's a W. All right, and look at that. We just sold our power up. It should come up here. And if you guys see the top right corner there, we now have 222,000 coins. And that is because that power up Nick Chubb that we sold. So making coins even in the video. Let's go. Now, if you guys are wondering what soul challenge you needed to do, uh, you go over to the play tab under the challenges. And uh, I'll show you guys right here. Essentially, you just want to do the NFL epics. Now, the way that you do that is you have to go through each one of these. You have Larry Fitzgerald, Adrian Pearson, Ronnie Lott, and Jack Youngblood on these basic solo strings not the moment ones on these right here you only have to get 40 stars I, i'm not gonna lie i realized that towards the end of these which was uh, a dumb decision for me because i wasted a lot of time but you really only need 40 stars and then you get the moment and then the moment you literally just need to get one star and then you get the 85 overall i would suggest doing these 100 percent it's just gonna really help round out your team uh and then for the nfl rivals this actually takes a while again i showed this in my last video but uh you you need a lot of stars you don't need 195 i don't think maybe you do i, I don't think you do i don't think you need a 
all of the 195 stars but you need a solid amount just make sure to do all these it's not gonna take that long maybe two two three hours at the most but i would get this done and that's so you can get like the jalen smith and there it goes nick chubb auction sold twenty two thousand six hundred and thirty five coins thank you very much ea now if we actually look at my collectibles here i have a solid amount of power up passes we have three of the 82 to 84 overall so i want to say in the next video i might try to use these i'm not exactly sure because training is definitely extremely expensive at this point so i might hold off using these until training drops down a little bit but these were all acquired just through grinding mutt levels well boys that is it for episode one episode number one of no money spent if we can get this video to 1000 likes i'll pump out episode two tomorrow i don't know what i'm gonna have in store i don't think we're quite head to head ready but we should acquire a lot of players. I might wait until the next day to get it out just so that the episode is like super crazy. I don't wanna just spam out episodes and the episodes not be the absolute best that they can be. So get this video to a thousand likes and I'll try to get it out tomorrow. Either way though, boys, hope you all did enjoy. If you did, make sure to drop a like down below, subscribe if you are new and guys, I will see you in my next upload. Peace. I'm so, I'm so